Hey there, so this commentary is going to be about the upcoming consoles, the Xbox 720 and the PS4 I think they are called or I don't know, I think no one really knows if they are called that way but yeah, we're going to talk about consoles and yeah, my experience with it. So yeah, recently I was playing on the PS3, I was playing Black Ops 2 and it was a very very weird experience for me just because Ever since I can remember, I probably played on the PC. You know, I started off oh, with some kind of PC, you know, like a Commodore C64, I think they were called. Or, you know, all those old computer thingies and those crappy machines. And they had this funny little games with really shitty graphics. And <laughs> but yeah, I was playing with a mouse and a keyboard, or basically with a keyboard, because the first games only were keyboard games or only mouse games, whatever. But yeah, mouse and keyboard. Of course I had a PSX when that console was new and I had a Super Nintendo and a normal Nintendo and I don't know, I think I had a, how was it called, a Sega Mega Drive or something like that? I have no idea, but yeah, I, I had consoles, but you know, I was always drawn to PC gaming and by the time the game Counter-Strike came out, I was just a PC player only, there was nothing else because on a console I don't know it's just uh, the first consoles didn't have multiplayer or they had a local multiplayer but you couldn't play on the internet so yeah I could you know hop on my PC and game with basically millions of people all around the world of course I couldn't do that because I had a crappy internet connection but in theory I could do that and you know that was the thing that was really you know, ah, the interesting thing about that, that was the only thing that, you know, was really sucking at consoles because, yeah, you couldn't do that. You could just play for yourself or maybe with one friend or two friends, three friends. Was that possible? I don't know. But, yeah, you had to play alone and it was kind of boring and the multiplayer was, you know, the, the upcoming thing. It was the best thing ever. <laughs> so I was a PC player. And ever since then I have never played on a console, sometimes I think I played on a Wii or I played on a PS2 for once, I don't know, but I never really got into console gaming again, I was a PC player, so yeah, using mouse and keyboard. And when I was playing on the PS3 with the controller, it felt so weird and... Don't get me wrong, I love controllers for racing games, for example, or for fighting games like Street Fighter vs. Tekken, or how it's called, or Street Fighter X Tekken, I have no idea. But yeah, I love controllers for that, that's gotta be awesome, they, they feel better, they are better than a keyboard, and for racing games, of course, they are better than a keyboard. But whenever I play a first-person shooter with a controller, I tried playing, you know, Black Ops 2 with my Xbox controller on PC, and it just... No, it feels so wrong. It just feels like a controller isn't made for first-person shooters. It's, it's just my opinion. I, I just doesn't, you know, I don't like the feeling. And I really like the feeling of, you know, pointing my mouse at something and clicking one button. It's just, it seems very easy and I don't have to care about hand-eye coordination, basically, because it's somewhat taken care of by my brain, so <laughs> it's easy for me. And now with the upcoming consoles, the Xbox 720 and the PS4, I think PC games will really benefit from that because, you know, if the consoles have high-end technology, we can have high-end graphics on the consoles, and because of that, PC games will have high-end graphics at last, you know? <laughs> because Black Ops 2 only has shitty graphics and a shitty engine because of the fact that consoles don't have the technology to support new technology there, new engines. You know, you can't put a Crytek, is it called Cry Engine? Yeah, Cry Engine 3 on a, you know, on a console. It just doesn't work really well. The graphics will look shitty and it just isn't good. But on a PC with modern and good technology, you can basically use photorealistic graphics it's just awesome and i think we are going to have a you know a huge advance in graphics once and in engines of course once the new consoles hit and the pc will benefit from that but other than that half a year after these consoles will be released their technology will be outdated again and i just fear that it will take maybe five six years before the next consoles will come out and yeah, then we are in the same situation. The PC will have to suffer with bad graphics just because the consoles can't be upgraded. And that's just horrible. And I don't want to do that, you know? <laughs> I want to have the, the best possible graphics th there are just because technology supports it. I want to have that. Don't take that away from me, consoles, please. <laughs>
<sighs> but yeah, so what do you think about the upcoming Xbox 720 and the PS4? Just leave it in the comment section below and yeah, rate the video, of course, share it. That would be great because it really helps me out. It helps my channel grow. So yeah, and subscribe, of course, <laughs> if you're new around right here and if you enjoyed this commentary. And that was it for this time. <laughs> I'm Lost Link, signing out.